Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Planet Explorers on Merlin 1977. Let's continue where we left off. So in our last episode we finished out Gertie's mission. We brought Gertie from Carter Camp up to the Martian colony. I went uh, in our last episode I actually made my way to one of the three locations that Otaro asked me to check up on. Uh, the first location was empty, so there was nobody there. The second location, if you can look, see the little black dots, uh, those are people. So we're going to meet up with some new survivors up here. I'm very close to that area. So, oh, we also, uh, like I uh, said, we also sort of made our way up into this biome. Uh, it's sort of a, it, it's sort of a forest continuation biome except uh, we have some new plants and uh, let me see can I pick this up yep ah, it's all plant fiber there are new plants a couple of new trees around uh, as those you can see in the background uh, a couple of new trees same animals as the, the regular forest so there was nothing new there but Let's uh, let's have a little chit chat with some new people. If we can find them. They should be somewhere around here. And here's some more new trees. Have an interesting texture. Ah, look at that. So there is an actual camp here. Look at that. Really cool with the fire awesome and that still has not popped up on my map now it's popped up alright so this is what wilds camp cool what's up everybody is that a turtle really you're alive yes I'm alive wait Dude, you have a turtle. How'd you get a turtle on this planet? Okay, uh, nice outfit, by the way. Yeah, I'm alive. What's up? Glad to see you. Where did <laughs> where did you land at? Uh, long ways away. Who's Janab? I'm guessing that's the guy back there. Anyone else? Ah, that's the leader of the camp. How do you have a turtle, dude, on this planet? Can I, can I pick it up? Nope. Alright, let's have a little chit-chat with everybody. I'm guessing I can talk to everybody. Yep. So, Pleiades Zeng. I don't think we've met. No, we haven't. The Epiphany was a big ship. I'm Pleiades, a virologist. Oh, do we have anything to worry about on this planet? You betcha. Even though the DNA structure on this planet is somewhat different from ours, the viruses should still be able to adapt to us quickly. I haven't had the time to use my instruments yet, but I have identified several viruses and bacteria already. I'll need to analyze them further to see if they pose a threat to us. Uh, how have you fared so far? As well as one can hope. I guess before you came along, we thought we might have been the last human remnant on this planet. We wanted to head a bit further north to look for Epiphany, but with Viola, Ko, and Anjum gone, we're holding fort for now. Anjum is actually at my base, so... I've created a colony- ooh, nice! Uh, so I can invite these guys to my base camp, very cool. Uh, before I do that... I don't know how many more I can take. Uh, dwellings. Crap. I can only put two more. So I need to get another bed. I can only put two more people on my base for now. Uh, Alright. But I can, uh, you know what? I can fast travel to this place now since it's on my map. So if I need to, I can come back here and grab these guys. But let's, uh, let's talk to Janab. Nice to see you, Janab. Nice to see you alive and kicking as well. We've been fe uh, fearing the worst ever since we landed. 
Andrew went looking for other survivors, but we haven't heard back yet. And I don't even want to think about what happened to the rest of the Epiphany. Actually, Andrew found us. That's why I came. I'm currently setting up more permanent colony. I'll come and get you once it's done. Oh, finally, some good news. How many of you came down on this boat? Let's see, 10 people came down on this lifeboat. Mr. Nahas went south to search for survivors, while Viola Strand went north with Cole Ironstan. Um, Viola, she was looking for her Todd, so she left in a hurry after we landed. I hope she's alright. Actually, do you think you can go find them? They went in this general direction. I... We were too afraid to go after them. Sure, I can go. Uh, have you seen any of the natives? We had a couple of run-ins already. More like staring contests. Both times ended without incident. I fear what will happen if they will come again. Blasted intelligent aliens. Can you believe that? I have this conflicting feeling of happiness and fear all rolled into one. Well, mostly fear. And he can come to my base as well. Ronaldo. Ronaldo! Can't believe this is what happened once we got on the planet. Not what we had in mind, huh? Now, put on a brave face and we can still win the day. How's Tony? What the heck is Tony? Tony's right here. Hey, little buddy. See who's... Oh, Tony's the, uh... <laughs> okay. Buddy, buddy. I guess, uh, this little turtle is named Tony. Isn't there a kind of a rule of thumb not to bring animals on your new planet? You know, mess up the uh, biome and all that. Anywho, let's continue our conversation. So, tell me again why you came on this mission. I'd love to hear that tale again. Oh man, not this again. <laughs> okay, okay. So, there I was. The rain pouring down. 20 triad strongmen on one side of me. Uh, me on the other side. I was shivering, but only because it was cold. I shouted with the force of a hurricane. Back off, for thou shalt never again see the light of day. With that, I cried havoc and let slip the dogs of war. I can still taste the fear in their eyes that night. Afterward, the FBI decided I was too much trouble for the witness protection program and shipped me here. The end. So he can come to my base as well, and let's have a chit chat with the leader. Michael, actually, can we kind of talk face to face? You're Michael Wiles, right? Yes, I'm the lead civil engineer on this colony mission. Have you seen any other colonists? No, actually, you're the first that we've seen. Uh, I'm real glad there are more human survivors on this continent. Where did you land? Have you seen my wife, Deanna? Never heard of her, actually. We landed southeast of here. She's an officer on the flight deck, so she's probably still with the Epiphany. I'm so worried. I, I can't do anything about it. Have you seen any of the natives? Yeah, they came and surrounded us a couple of times. Their intelligence was obvious. Luckily for us, for us they didn't do anything. Sounds like you ran into more hostile ones. Alright, let's see what he sells. Anything new? Colony pants, really? Alright, this is junk. <coughs> Track joint script. I have no idea what this is. Oh! The monorail stuff. Ah! Alright, so I definitely need to buy this stuff from him. Wait, uh, do I have any more... Alright, so I'm going to have to get some more of this. Big dirt. Let's build it out. I have 35 grand left. Wow. 35,000 dirt block. I mean, yeah. So I run, I run out of this pretty quickly. Alright, let's do uh, a bunch of these. 
to have nothing else to do with all this dirt. Alright, five should be enough. Alright, so let me sell you my junk here. Where's my dirt? Alright, uh, monorail parts. I'm guessing I have to... Well, yeah, I need a whole bunch of these, right? So, instead of buying that... Well, let me see what they cost to make in terms of um, resources. So, I'm going to buy this from him. The track script the track end script and the track joint script and I can sell on my dirt again and I could probably you know what I could probably oh boy 1700 bucks yikes uh, 8 9 yeah so then I'll have yep I can send up two more of these uh, actually you know what let me see what let me see what it costs to make these. So they should be on the bottom, right? Yeah. Transmitter. Do I, uh, okay, track and. Ah, so what do I need? I need glass small, which I've been buying out a lot of, and and the transmitter. So this takes. One iron, one copper, and three simple plastic. So I can build out a ton of these. Alright, I'm not worried about that. I have, I can build that. And I need, oh jeez, 20 aluminum alloys. Uh, aluminum, copper, and silicon. So I, I do have a lot of this stuff. Well, clearly, I'm going to have to buy these out. Um, and I need my factory replicator, too, on top of that. So I'm going to have to go back to my base to build it. Uh, all right. So the station platform, 25 steel. Nah. I want to save my stuff. So I can buy these out from him. You know what? I can sell them. Where'd he go? Michael, get over here. I can sell them this, which I don't need. Three. Actually, hold on. Um, so if I buy this, yeah, if I buy this out, I that'll be 17, 1800, and I can sell them one of my big dirts. So, yep. Make one of these. 1800, sell you my big dirt. 161, buy one of these. 1700, sell you my big dirt. And can you buy this for me? No, alright, 50 bucks. So I have enough for that. Uh, 304, he still doesn't have enough for me to. That's okay. Alright, so I, I basically have one more big dirt. Let me see what these other guys have in, in the shop. Oh, you guys don't have a shop. Darn. And you don't have a shop either. And you have a shop. You... You have a shop, John Eb. Fuel... Oh, wow. Fuel cell type 04. Nice. Jesus! 7900. What the hell? Are you kidding me? And train cart. Oh, man. Ah, there goes all my money. Alum oh, there we go. Aluminum armor. So I have to come all the way up here to buy the aluminum armor again. So they changed it up. So he sells the aluminum armor. Yep. Uh... Gold gloves, gold boots, gold helmet. So I need gloves and boots. I need go. I need gloves and boots. I. Uh, you know what? I probably should have bought the. I should have bought the scripts for this when I had a chance. So now I'll know next time. 
to, to just buy the scripts. Uh, but, here, you can buy my Gatling gun script. And, man, 4,000 bucks. Jeez. I don't even think, you know what, the fuel I could probably... Wait, he can come to my base, right? Yep, alright, so I can get all that stuff for free from him, never mind. Uh, yeah, actually, you know what, I'm gonna invite him to my base, because this guy's got all the goodies. And that way I can buy all this stuff for free. Or get all this stuff for free. Uh, man, look at it, 8,000 bucks, are you kidding me? Jeez, man, and what is this? Train cart, uh, train cart. Alright, let me do one more trade for the script for the train cart. Uh, what is this? Uh, 17 and 35. Oh, man. Where's my... Oh, did I sell the last of my junk? Yeah, I did. Wow. So, I'm definitely gonna invite him to my base so I can get that stuff for free. Man, that is just ridiculously expensive. So, there, so this guy has a fuel cell type of 4. Uh, yeah, let me sell him one of these. Well... Again, I could probably... I mean, I could get all his meat too. So, yeah, forget it. Alright, you know what? Let me invite him to my camp because he's, uh, he's one of the important guys in the game and uh, come to my base all right so I'll meet him up I'll meet up with him at my base these two him I don't think I can invite over can I no yeah, but he doesn't really have very much uh, or anything of interest yeah he's got junk guard gloves colony pen all right you have nothing so him I can't invite. I can invite two more, which is this dude. I wonder if his total is gonna come along with him. But he has no shop. So I don't really need him. I only have room for one more. I'll come back for these guys afterwards. What I wanna do is I wanna head I want to head over here to finish out this mission. Or to finish that out essentially. But I can always fast travel here. Um I do kind of like the fact that these things kind of glow. Uh, the plants on that side. Uh, let's see, anything... Do they have anything here? Repair machine or... Anything? They have nothing at this camp. What the heck? What kind of lame nonsense is this, man? You guys have nothing here. Nothing. Worthless base camp you guys have built. Can I steal their... their... Nope. Cannot steal that either. Uh, alright, well... Let's see if there's anything around here then. I guess I probably should have done that at the other place too, but... Anything? Wow, this is about as worthless of a base camp as you can possibly have. Thanks for nothing, guys. Jeez. Uh, yeah, alright. Well, I can fast travel here, so I'm going to take my little trip to that other area. In which direction? I'm guessing this direction. That direction? Yep, alright. Wait, big dirt. Ooh, uh... Alright, so I do have... Alright, so I have four big dirts. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's head down. Head down to the other place. Oh, wrong direction.
little more. Alright, I think, yep, that's good. So let's go. Uh, yikes, no, 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 no. I do not want to hit any of these trees. Because that happens. I can't get out, damn it. Very annoying. Can I get through? Yep, alright. There we go. So this actually looks pretty cool from the air. All these glowing plants and stuff. I, I really like the way that looks. Yep, alright, let's let's head. Oh, ah! Please do not hit any more trees. Is uh, my Death Star actually gets destroyed, which is very funny. Oh, I'm gonna be attacked. Ooh, I thought I was gonna be attacked. I saw that on my mini map. All right, straight ahead. Let's go. All right. Nice and easy. No, how did that hit? Come on, seriously, how did that hit? Oh, wait, it's a little further up here. So we're back to we're back to this biome by the way, which uh, I can kind of set down my You know what? Uh, let me get on uh, actually, no, that's a bad idea, bad idea. So if I set my, my Death Star down, it's gonna roll, roll down the hill. So... Wait, am I... Oh, crap. I do not want to be attacked. Hold on. Alright, get, get, get down, get down. Stop, stop, stop. Just get down, and... Well, let's go. Just get down here. At least I'm not being attacked by any of the other animals, flying creatures. So that that's that's a positive. Come on, nice and easy. Done. Alright. What the heck is that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who's firing what? Oh, crap. Whoa, 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 whoa. Holy crap. Yeah, holy crap is right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? Holy shit, what the hell? Whoa, what is going on here? Okay, that was not right. What the hell? Alright, well, you guys can... Can kill each other, man. What the hell? Alright, well, they're obviously getting killed. It's not me doing it. Okay, I did not see that coming at all. So I guess these guys are all fighting against each other. What the hell? I just walked into a war zone, man. What the hell? I guess maybe I should have done this, done this in the daylight. All right, I want all of the bullets, 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 bullet, bullets. Come on. Wait, are these guys? Nope, they're not friendlies. Never mind. Bastards, man. And I, I really need to. Oh, and we have that too. Oh, awesome. Great. Alright, let me kind of get up here quickly.
I need something to eat super quick. Alright, Pujan salad it is. I need something, yeah, that will do that. Alright, where is the other dude? Oh, crap. Shoot! Run! Run! I can't- Oh, come on, man! I can't run! Alright, this is really pissing me off. I I have to fight a whole posse of these guys. What the hell? I, get, I can't even run. Ah. Uh, I need to- Alright, I definitely need to get the hell out of here. And I think they're just gonna linger around. Maybe they'll go away. Wow, that sucks. So bad. What the hell is that? Alright, so clearly they're just, this is their base camp up here. So I need to run. Oh, they're just... Yeah, okay. So, see you later. Run, 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 run. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Crap, crap, crap. See you later. Alright. Get the hell out of here, man. Get the hell long. Hell. Oh my god! Really? Alright, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Are they still coming after me? Yeah, they are. Wow. Alright, so I'm gonna just strafe the hell out of this place. Oh crap. Figures I'd run out of freaking. Oh man, that was horrible. Oh shoot, shoot. Oh, come on! Leave me the heck alone! Hold on. Where are the bandages and whatnot? Alright, that's one. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, so I'm fully healthy now. That pissed me the hell off. Man, that pissed me off. What is going on? That is a freaking Pujan camp, man. What is that nonsense? Ah, oh, of course they're still coming. You know what? The hell with you guys. Yeah, keep coming. Because I can see you coming now. Give me give me back my bullets. I'm gonna, I'm gonna destroy your entire freaking population, man. Because that sucked royally. I did not see that coming at all. And then I'm guessing... Oh, oh, oh. Someone just shot. Yep, I saw that. Saw that gun. Ah! Come on. Alright, who's this dude that's shooting? There's this one guy that's just shooting his freaking rocket launcher at me. Oh, are you kidding me? Man, when it rains, it pours. Jeez. Like, I need you guys. To, to uh, attack me too. Oh, crap. Come on. Where the heck is that damn alien? Of course. Yeah, I know. I saw you coming. Yeah, I know. You're dead. You're dead too. Okay, good. Oh, wow. Good shot. Direct hit. Holy crap, man. Apparently, there's one guy that's just following me around. And I cannot see him because I don't have the vantage point. He's got the high, he's got high ground. I can't see him at all. Freaking! I 
Guys are everywhere, man. All right, so I think there's he's coming. Is he? I need a I need a better vantage point. Okay, so this clearly sucked really bad. <laughs> Man, that was horrible. I think that one dude is still following me. Well, go ahead. Come on down. I can't see him at all, though. I gotta keep strafing, though. Alright, there has to be one dude. Oh, this thing was following me? out of here man stop wasting my time all right so obviously I'm hopefully safe here where the hell is this place all right so that thing was like over here right Pujan camp jeez oh, I'm coming back there. I'm gonna destroy that whole freaking place man that place is done I'm gonna obliterate this entire place. Ah, oh, that was horrible. Alright, I need a little breather. My... I think my... Armor took a beating. I'm probably gonna head back home. And grab some stuff. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna grab some, some uh, materials and whatnot. And I'm coming back for this place. Uh, so I'm probably gonna just cut out this you know, cut this episode here because that was highly unexpected and I'm coming I'm definitely coming back I'm gonna go home I want to talk to that guy uh, from the wild Wiley camp and grab a whole bunch of uh, items from him uh, most most likely the aluminum armor scripts and everything else <clears throat> and uh, what else did he sell? I think he sold another uh, monorail component, which I'm also going to get. So I'm just going to do that for the remainder of the evening here, or game time evening, I should say. And and after that, uh, we'll kickstart a new episode. And uh, man, that sucks so bad. Ah, oh, I hate not even seeing that. And that's the first one too. That was the first one on the map. Because it went from like here to here to here. That sucked. Uh, I'm still ticked off about that. You have no no idea. I haven't died that badly in a, in a quite quite a bit. Fairly long time actually. So anyway, I'm gonna cut this episode here. Uh, that was more exciting than I thought it would be. But uh, we'll regroup and I'm going to go and attack the living hell out of that place. Uh, I'm probably going to attack it with one of these puppies up here. I don't know. <clears throat> uh, might, I might pick uh, the X-Wing or something to go beat him up. But I don't know. We'll, we'll go destroy something. So uh, that's it for this episode, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.